Yes, my name is Shani and my co-partner name is Jayanti. Now our topic is about encapsulation. So before going to talk about encapsulation, first of all, I just want to give some point about OOPS. Everyone know right OOPS, Object Oriented Programming Language. Yes, in the name itself, we are, we are knowing that Object Oriented Programming Language. See. We are orienting the object by using some fundamental principles. In that fundamental principles, the first one is encapsulation. The encapsulation is a processing of the binding the data into a single unit in Java. We are called as class. The data can be variables and methods which declare the within the private access modifiers. The scope of the private access modifiers within the class. In order to in order to scope up the outside outside the classes, we are using the public setters and getters methods. Yes, public setters and getters method. Okay, everyone don't know like why public setters and getters method. Here we are using the getter method to write to get the attributes. Got it? So here we are using setters method to write the variables to write the attributes. Okay. The setters and getters methods are increasing the scope of private access modifier outside the class. Thank you.